Welcome everyone to a whirlwind of Karen encounters. In this episode, witness a Karen who hates graduations, another harassing a journalist at a cafe, creating chaos at her drive through and an entitled Karen cutting in line at Target. Buckle up for these jaw-dropping moments that epitomize the wild world of Karens. Despite receiving her refund, Karen has a complete meltdown, escalating a situation unnecessarily. I, mean, I, I have enough. never talked to anyone more disrespectful. <laughs> I've you know that's been recording since you walked in, so. Hi! What do you think I'm afraid of? <laughs> uh. Karen wasn't happy with prices, so told the worker she was going to complain to a manager. What is he meant to do? Make special prices for her? So you're refusing to give me a yes, because it's all online. The corporate members online, miss. I don't mean everybody's house. I'm coming from him. Look, I'm not my mother. You got my phone over a watching right now. Karen escalates by calling cops on a lady who parked in her spot, sparking unnecessary conflict over a parking space. Was Karen seriously about to throw some punches over some chicken? Remember that, okay? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> she, said, um, she said, she she said, I'm going to punch you. Yeah. You're so mad. It yeah. was so weird. <laughs> like just a few cars for some chicken. This guy stood up for the bus driver after Karen was constantly complaining about being late. He just matched her attitude and gave her some of her own medicine. This is New York. This is New York. Everybody late. Everybody. Because you're lousy, that's why you are late. Everybody late. This is New York. You want to be on time, go to Jamaica and walk to work. <laughs> if I was there, I would have get there. You're going to be late. That's it. You're going to be late. I don't give a sh where I want to come from. Or where you be mad at him because you're late? I'm not from Jamaica either, so you're talking from me. <laughs> well, wherever you from, well, you might be on time if you walk there. To, I was talking to the driver. But you're annoying me, so now yeah, I'm going to speak I'm on it. I'm in the house. <laughs> annoying oh, me. I get there now. You live the house? You I'm going to live the house. You know what it is? You upset because you got a bull <laughs> job. <laughs> and you late to your bull <laughs> job. You can't buy a car because you got a don't be mad. Karen goes on a rampage over a nearby school graduation party, unleashing fury due to its proximity to her home. Karen hates graduations. I have asked you to stop. You won't stop. You think this is funny? Stop. It's a uh, graduation celebration. Karen harasses a journalist at a cafe, disrupting their work and causing unnecessary disturbance. I've got lots of praise, but I haven't got time to actually. Yeah, well, you don't need to harass her just for working I'm not harassing her. You are. You're harassing me now. I am not. I'm. Well, that's all. Well, that's all I was doing to have. I was She's saying, my customer, and I'm a customer too. Okay, and I was just saying 
that the ABC spread lies and she's part yeah, of a company that is handling lies. She's an employee of the company. She's not the one deciding what they report. But do you, do you just, understand she, what I'm saying? She just said she reports on sugar cane. Listen, do you understand what I'm saying? I, I, like, do you, do, do you um, see where I'm coming from? She doesn't have to see my point of view. She doesn't have to. That's I'm the asking point. her. No, but that's the point. You don't I, need a, you I, don't, you I don't appreciate that, that you have your opinion. opinion. Yes, yes. That is does. totally fine. Everyone is allowed to have their opinions. Um, I mean, I'm just here. But it's, it's, it's actually, it's actually, it's she's actually, everyone here, knows. She's just here trying to get coffee. Like, you're probably just here but trying I'm just, to get yeah. so you don't but, need but I'm just saying, your opinion on her. you need to. I'd like you to leave. Excuse me. I actually want to leave. And I actually don't. I want you to leave. Excuse I'd me. love to not yeah. actually give you my money. That's fine. Um, ABC it sucks. All the media yeah, sucks. All right. Thank and you. Thanks for your thoughts. thoughts. Karen retaliates to honking by sitting on a couple's car and when confronted, throws her coffee and food at them in an aggressive outburst. Karen creating chaos in Toronto. This woman is going to f*** now. Look at her. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ma'am. Oh! Oh! Oh my god! Oh! Oh my god, I... On a Saturday afternoon... Not the fries. Oh my god, she's gonna run you over. She is not in her right mind. Don't even go in front of her car. Oh. <gasps> Hell, now you don't even have your food. It's not worth it. It is not worth it. Entitled Karen bypasses the line at Target, showing no regard for others waiting their turn, but then gets put in her place by the lady in front of her. This so Karen tried to cut my client in me. line you at Target. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. I want and the back up. right here now. And back up. And this is all on video. I didn't do anything wrong. Exactly, because you thought you were going to get in front of me. Okay, thanks, exactly. Just get your shit and get out of here. Who you f***ing say? You. You're not talking to me. <laughs> I am trying to make a return here. Like, and that's exactly what I'm what doing. So why you think you're so entitled? You thought you were going to come and stand in front of me? And then I correct you about what you did. You thought you were going to come and get in my face. We're not I'm doing not that today. Face. You did get in my face. No. And I got it on video. Stop playing Whatever. with me. Stop playing with me. I was here first. I came the correct way. Like well, all customers should. Just get done. She jumped. I'm not talking to you. She jumped in front of me, and this young lady knows she came from this way. And then she said, well, I have a return. Ma'am, I'm already standing right here. Just get it over with. Right. Wait, you made a big deal about it. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You did. Now stop playing with me. For real. I can take over here. Last warning, lady. Really good. Last warning. Oh, no. $31.59. Okay. Do you, you need my card? Do you want it back on your debit card? You can give it to me in cash. Cash? A local Karen confronts a guy waiting for his friend, demanding information and threatening to call the cops when refused, escalating a situation over trivial matters. My friend? What? I'm waiting for my friend. Who's your friend? I don't know. They sent me the address. I'm in the neighborhood. Who's your friend? You don't need to know my friend. Oh, well, you can call the cop. There's yeah. a lot of people stealing a lot of stuff. I'm not going to steal anything. Well, we don't know that, do we? Yeah, you don't know that. I don't know that. You don't know me. I know. I don't know you. And well, you're asking a lot here. of questions. I live here, yes. That's fine. I'm not in your house. No, you're not. I'm in the, the street. Yeah, I didn't see that. So can you uh, get away from my car, please? Um, no, it's a public street. Okay, well, I can close my window. Karen causes a scene berating the manager for being asked to leave after publicly urinating in a cup. That's just gross. I'm a bad bladder. I don't think you understand what women's bladders are all about, but I really have a bad bladder. Okay. 
And there's no reason for you to justify me or judge me. I am not judging you, ma'am. You are, sir. No, I'm not. Tom. I'm not judging you. Can I'm you here to see your manager? Because it's I okay. am the manager. Somebody I hire up, sir. What? I'm asking you to leave property for your actions and behavior. Not a problem, Tom. But I needed a hearing aid. And I needed a pee on my... There's been times where I have to hold a cup for my job, Tom. I am a, I am a teacher, a speech therapist, sir. I literally have to urinate in a cup. Because I don't have time to go to South Central on Slauson and Crenshaw to urinate, sir. I cannot believe you're judging me. I'm not judging you, No problem. It's okay. I will leave, but I'm telling my family member what's happening here. And they can meet me at the parking lot because there is a commute time. It's literally an hour to drive to the valley, Tom. Okay, what? I'm okay, what? It sounds like you're your just, just saying okay, yes, but I need I'm a manager. I'm saying okay. I went talk. to Alani, to Hawaii in April, Tom. I paid for your paycheck, sir. Everybody else is here. Just so you know, I'm not a like freeloader. I never said that. I'm just putting it out there. So I'll give you time to discuss the parking arrangement. Thank you, Unfortunately, sir. Unfortunately, I can't get I you will, to I will leave. No, thank you, Tom. Entitled couple denied service at a cafe due to Karen's mask refusal, sparking a scene as they make a fuss over the whole situation. Don't get involved. Don't get involved. Hey, don't get involved. Stop. I'm the wrong person to get involved yeah. with. You have no idea who I am. Don't do it. I'm just warning you. Don't do it. No, I'm just saying stop. don't. Stop. You weren't here when this started. Yes. I was what, being nice. Put your mask on. The virus will attack them. Put it on. What's up, guys? Why, so why you can argue. They won't serve me. They won't serve me because these people don't have masks. Needs to be on while you're ordering in the cafe. Would but this guy right here. Doesn't she have it on? Uh, look at this side. Need to have it on. If you're Screw it then. No, then I don't. If need you're sitting down and eating, what's your name? I'm Ashley. Yeah, Ashley. You need to pay attention. Tell them to put their mask on. Then. Okay. If you're sitting down eating the mask. You guys are falling for when this. When you're sitting down eating, do you hear what are you thinking? When you're sitting down eating, the virus won't affect anybody. That is a. Don't be brainless. That's and great. you don't get involved where you're not supposed to, unless you know who you're talking to. Honestly. He, no, no, just no. come on, your own business. I was here being kind by first order. I was very kind. Don't mind your own business, lady. Don't, don't get involved. We're the wrong people. Trust me on that. I'm the overseer. Don't get involved. 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 Don't get But everybody's hands are out, but the virus doesn't affect your hands, really? Make sure you change your gloves when you go back. This Karen comes into Petco all the time just to gaslight the workers. Well, it worked this time, and this worker was not letting it slide. but please don't take it out on me, go okay? Ahead, go ahead, go ahead. $5.73. Like I said, please don't take... No, don't take your anger out on me. Exactly. Please don't shush us. That's really rude. No, that is really rude. I'm sorry. No, let's... Go ahead. You know, I want to buy these and go. I'm not here to take criticism and crap from you. Okay. No 
every time. We are so nice to you every time you come in. When you disrespect us, no. I am not going to listen to you shush me. You can listen to us. No. You're disrespectful to everyone here. You're disrespectful to everyone at this Petco. 71. 570, right? Yeah, 570. But you actually gave me two cents less, so I need two more pennies, please. Have a great day. Enjoy your holiday. It's not hard to be nice. I'm tired of every time she comes in here, she treats us like Karen parks this couple in and then tries to gaslight them into moving into a park that's not even there. Karens just have nothing better to do, and usually fold to be the victim once the police arrive. A so, real-life um, Karen in action. This Karen right here calls the police because she doesn't want to, she doesn't want to close her door to let us pull into our parking spot to get into our apartment. So she calls the police. So now I'm sitting here waiting on the police to get here. For what? I don't know. It's no other spots. <laughs> so she's just sitting here looking stupid. Look how dumb she look, y'all. She looks f***ing dumb. <laughs> I cannot wait till the police gets here. She looks so stupid. And I'm gonna sit here and record this and wait till the police get here. <laughs> Cause what the fuck? <laughs> this is ridiculous. Cause you know what I mean? She wanted a violent reaction. Yeah, she they no. They want you to be violent. <laughs> the they, didn't get it. they want you to do that. <laughs> so no, I can be calm just like you. What? We can both do that. It's okay. <laughs> so she's sitting here we waiting for the police to get here i guess yeah i don't know what they gonna do besides tell her to close that door exactly and let us because we're both residents <laughs> of this apartment complex and there's no assigned parking spots none <laughs> first come first save close your door oh so i wish i would have started safe. recording this is ridiculous. Look at her. She's standing in the really car. Really don't show how her door is. Oh, I did. I saw how it was. It's like that. To where we can't get parked in. Now she's finna go get her groceries out on, her, on the other side of the door. No she's finna go. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure. Right now it's no room. Right. No, I'm she sure. Yeah. She you feel dumb are... yet? Because <laughs> the police not going to do nothing. We're both residents. Don't walk up on my car. <laughs> don't walk up on my car. <laughs> Don't walk up on my car. Don't walk up on my car. I'm recording you, Karen. So what? I know it's so what? You're mad. You're angry. You're upset. You're frustrated. Not even parked in the right spot. What do you mean? There's no assigned spots. Yeah, because I can't get back there. Why? Because your door. Because your door. But you can close your door, Karen, so I can back up. And then how do I get the groceries out of the car? Once I park, Karen, you can open your door. You sound stupid. You sound dumb. Oh, yeah, <laughs> now real dumb. Yeah, because um, I'm sure you there's do is been be other times where it's been two spots <laughs> and you got your groceries out. Possible. You made it away, Karen. What's Stop talking to me. Back the, back, the back the up, Karen. Back the up, Karen. Back up, Karen. Back up. Stop. Back up. I feel unsafe. <laughs> She's so talking about it's impossible. How is it impossible to get your groceries out of the car? Yeah, the police really need to hurry up. Yeah. Need to call them. Yeah, call the police. <laughs> Please call them. We're about to call the police to speed this up. Mm -hmm. Look, she getting her groceries out. <laughs> and still got her door open. That's crazy.
Um, mm -hmm. No one is here. Can you see her? Yeah, she's yeah, still she's... right here. That's what I said. She had already called the police. That's why I was calling back because at okay. this point, she's literally just stopping me from going in the house. I just got my girlfriend from work. We were just trying to go in. And she's literally blocking the only parking spot left with her door. And I don't want to. Look at the ignorance, y'all. The ignorance. By her door, or I don't want to touch her property by walking up closing her door. And she said that I assaulted, assaulted her. Exactly. Thing. So we're so staying I just in, stayed the car. in the car. And I'm waiting on somebody to get here. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Right. She closed. It. Wow, y'all. So she closed her door. I'm still gonna wait for the police to get here. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck! I'm still gonna wait for the police to get here. Here, you need to move so I can get out. <laughs> oh, we taking pictures of license plates. Okay, go. No. <laughs> I can do that too, lady. Right. We can get license plates, VIN numbers. What is we do and say? Cause we both live here. Exactly. <laughs> both our names on the list. Yeah. So I'm just so confused. Like, what's gonna happen? Yeah. Hmm. You have to pay bills. Oh, what you living out the government? You broke, bitch. Yeah, don't <laughs> it's not. I got a job. You have to live out the government. He said we living off the government. <laughs> We oh, don't. that was so racist, bro. Oh, I got all this on camera. You gonna go viral, bitch. This is crazy. Oh, shit. This can, is it's freedom of speech, right? Yeah. Can I say bitch? Yeah, I can say whatever I want to say. Like a female dog. Yeah. And what do dogs do? Act untrained. Yeah. Act untamable. Yeah. And what are you doing? Acting untamable. Yes. Because you didn't want to close your door. Yeah. So what are you? A roguish bitch? Yeah. The fuck is you talking mm. about? Yeah. Want to get technical we're not, with we're it? Not illiterate. Yeah, we're not. <laughs> so you can't try to play that with us. You can't. You <laughs> said we're going to stay here and wait on the officer. And you're gonna feel like a dummy. Yeah. Like <laughs> real dumb. <laughs> like are you because looking at you know why? Because you stopped us from parking. We didn't stop you from getting out of your car, <laughs> parking oh, your car. How? <laughs> she was you were out of your car. 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 Oh, here come the police. Here come the Thank police, y'all. Right here. Right here. Thank you God. Guys. That's fine. That's fine. We, called we definitely they called. Told the officer was here. Exactly. There's two officers, two stories. Exactly. Think about it. <laughs> so yeah. Hello. Okay. Uh, no, we she. After yeah, she we called. called after she called. So you basically, ahead, yeah. as we was okay. pulling okay. up. All right. Okay. So basically, okay. as we was. Okay. So right, as let's, let's calm down. What's going on? Oh, we're we calm. Chilling. We good. That's the crazy part. <laughs> but so basically, as we pulled in, because we just came from Walmart, and basically we were just getting a couple groceries. So we pull in, we see it's a parking spot here. You see how tight the parking spot is. Which one is this? Right here. The Nissan. Uh, mm -hmm. yes. oh, right. So basically, we pull up here, we back up, and we see no one is at the door with the doors open. So we like, well, where this person just go? We just seen them get out the car. We're thinking, okay, they finna close the door. But instead, she walks to her apartment comes back, stays there with the door open. We're like, can you close your door? She walks to the car and says, what? No, I'm getting my groceries out. And we said, what? What does that mean? You can close your door and get them out on the other side. Simple as that. So this one right this here. One? This one? Yes. Okay. So she left the driver door open as we were trying to uh, back in. Okay. And you then called you guys. And then called you and left it open the whole time while we just trying to back up and go into our apartment. Gotcha. And then once you guys got here, she finished getting her groceries out and closed her door and the waited for y'all. So we backed up. We had to crawl out of our car because we got to deal with the tight spots. This yeah, is what you got to deal yeah, with. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So you got to adjust. Yeah, yeah, of course. So you can't just be rude to other people because you want to accommodate your own self. Okay. Okay. So. So only verbal argument. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Nobody got physical. Argument? Oh, no. Okay. Okay. I just got, mm -hmm. we got to ask, of course. Okay. All right. Um, What would you want us to do? What do you want us to do? Oh, we chill. We good. Okay. We, we only good. called because she called and we were just trying to hurry up the process because we were trying to go in the house. Okay. We didn't want to mm -hmm. go in the house and y'all be out here and we seemed like we oh, did yeah. something wrong. Exactly. Yeah, I got you. Okay. Um, y'all didn't damage each other's cars or anything like mm -hmm. that, right? No, no property damage? Okay. Mm -mm. All right. So That's what we're trying to avoid. Right? Okay. So, good thing calling us out here. What I'd recommend is 
I mean, if you want to take it further, talk to your office, and maybe file a complaint. Right? Oh, yeah, we're going to call them in the morning. In the morning. Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. We can give you an incident number that we came out here and we talked to y'all, okay? okay. Uh, thankfully, nothing nothing happened, right? No offense took place, which is good. You know, I know it's frustrating, and I, I get yeah. it. I get it. It's, you know, it's rude. Tight spots as is. Apartment complexes are like that, unfortunately. Exactly. Yeah, first come, first serve. Especially getting off of work, we already got to deal with coming home from work to this, and then we got to deal exactly. with you leaving your door open. Yeah, yeah, I got you. Exactly. Yeah, honestly... You know, let's just go our separate ways tonight. Maybe, okay. um, where do y'all normally park? Where's your apartment? Uh, apartment's right there. Okay. okay, cool, cool. So y'all normally park on that side? It depends. It depends. Somebody just left, Somebody just left. Yeah, yeah. Just left. So, so, yeah, I got yeah, I feel it. Yeah, I feel it. Okay. Um, all right, well, yeah, let, let me let me give you an incident number that we can let me talk to y'all. Y'all can provide that to the apartment home, or the uh, management mm -hmm. and just say, hey, look, we had a dispute over a parking spot. It's not on your side. And just say, look, she was being rude. We just asked her to close the door so we could park and get out. Okay. And she, was, she was refusing, you know, and then police had to come out and, you know, she, she, she asked for it. It's just something you can say. Okay, okay cool. Um, but let me go ahead and get that. I think this next guy makes a point about that thing being 30 pounds and being able to get up to 80 kilometers an hour, but he definitely could have asked nicely. You're on your neighbor's lawn. Well, she never said anything to me. I, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, I was talking you know, to you. Like to I was talking to you. Line. I was talking to you and got distracted. Yeah. Yeah, what's it say? 30 pounds? Mm-hmm. 30 pounds. Yeah. 80 miles an hour. Yeah, and like I said, she never yeah, said well, anything to me. Yeah, I got a little background in physics and I can confuse She that. never said a thing to me Easily about it. kill a small child. Well, it's not, gonna, it's not going to kill here. anybody. You run around here. There's a tons of empty parking lots around here. Why don't you go to them? Okay. A lot of closed down stores. We don't need this fucking animal. animal Actually, you're, around. you're being animal actually yeah I'm you've been threatening you and being mean of us think. all you have to do is ask me nicely yeah that's it ask me nicely yeah well you were over here with your smaller one intimidating my dog when you first moved nobody in. knows that i never intimidated anybody yes you did you karen claims ownership of a public parking space films a guy parked there and goes berserk when he refuses to move causing unnecessary chaos yo so i come to my car i see this letter on my car i'm parked at my homeboy's crib and I get this letter, please do not park in front of our home. So I went and knocked on the door and asked why. It's a public street. And she said she owns this parking spot. She owns it. This guy right here is on my property. Cause I knocked on the door. Coming and knocking on my door and uh, causing us problems. I don't know who this guy is, but he needs to leave. And I asked, Can why you was leave she? My property? I'm not. No, I'm not on your property. Leave my property. I'm not on your property. Sure, leave my property. I'm on the sidewalk. I'm a public. Leave my property. I'm on public property. You need to leave my property. I don't. I can. I, don't, I can stay right here. Okay, that's it. That's it. That, that, I've had enough. <laughs> why are you laughing? Because that's the rudest shit I've ever seen in my life. What? Well, what? Well, this is a public street. This is a public street. This is a public street. So of course I'm gonna knock on your door. Then I'm gonna put a note on your car. Don't park in front of my house. This isn't. This is. Where's is, Where's it say this is property of? Two eight four five five Hidden Hills, right there. That's your earth. property. That's my property. No, it's not. Yeah. No, it's not. Can you leave? No, it's not. You don't live here, sir. It doesn't matter. I'm visiting. So do you do this for everyone that comes and visits? No, but there's people parking in front of my house. Continuing it doesn't matter. Can you please leave? I'm not, I'm not. This is, I'm, I'm, I have every right to be right here. You have right to stay there, but you don't have to be a jerk. Uh, you don't, this is a jerk. That's a jerk. No, please don't no. park in front of your house. Oh, you know what I'm going to do? I might just come out here and park every weekend right here. You sure could. You could and if you want to be a jerk. Okay. This is some rude ass shit. No, no, no. Yeah. Bro, you already know that's wrong. No, no. I'm asking you not to park in front of my house. Uh, well, you could ask all day long. Right. And you could say you're not going to. That's fine. But other than that, filming is just a childish little thing. No, no, no. This is childish, bro. No, you're being childish. No, 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 no. no. You... I'm not your bro. You're, you're being childish. 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 I'm not your bro. Like, it don't matter. No. You can call the police. You can call whatever. I need to call the police. Why would Wait, you whatever your wife is doing. My wife is not doing anything except saying, please don't park in front of her house. That's, well. And we're allowed to do that. This is America. And I, I'm allowed to knock on your door and ask why. You sure are. Right. Now you know the reason. So okay. have a nice day. Okay. Go about your business. Nah, man. 
Stupid no, no, this is yeah. stupid. No, that's not. That's stupid. Asking you to park in front of my, not parking in front that's, stupid. That's, not stupid. that's stupid. That's stupid, stupid. No, it's not. Yeah, because you don't own this. No, you're right. You don't own you it. You don't own it either. So I don't own it. You have to sit here and talk crap. And I, just go on I do not place. own it. You don't live here. Don't matter. You don't be visiting. Don't matter. matter. Any difference to me. Don't matter. Yeah, it does me. It okay. matters to me. Okay. So <laughs> I can have my opinion. Well, it matters to me that you wrote this letter. That doesn't matter. Yeah, go inside. I don't need to go inside. Go inside. Uh, this is my house. I can stand right here. I can stand right here on the grass right next to you if I want to. And I can stand right here. That's right. We can stand here all day and look like a couple of idiots. Or you can just go about your day. And I'm, not gonna, I'm not going to look like no damn idiot. You look like you're an idiot. You look like an idiot because you're filming right now. No, because really silly. Because you know. Because you know. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Well, then have them come over then. If that's the case. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, sheriff's are on the way. <laughs> Beautiful couple. Beautiful. Karen didn't have her dog leashed, and when asked, she kicks up a storm. Classic. Not one to follow any rules but her own. This Karen refused to put a leash on her dog at the park, and then threatened me when I asked her to leash her dog. on your dog. Not all dogs are friendly. Excuse me? I just asked you if you could put a leash on your dog. That's the rules here. Yeah, wow. Not every dog is friendly. Seriously. Seriously. Are you, oh, you'll do what? Oh, kick my ass. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. I, oh, seriously. I could call the police. There are rules here. Leash your dog. Karen, okay, Karen, whatever. Leash your dog. Put a leash on your dog. Please. Please. Calling me a b all because I asked you to put a leash on your dog. Calling me a b because I asked you to put a leash on your dog. 